could be this guy. Not even gonna tell you which one I think is the biggest scam. So this bait can be found on Amazon. It is straight from China. We know all great things come from China. That's why we're all stuck at home right now, right? Stop vibrating. Stop it. Oh, got one. What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's another episode of Bee Fishing and we are looking at what I think is the biggest scam on the internet. The biggest scam lure on the internet. It could be this guy or it could be this guy. Not even gonna tell you which one I think is the biggest scam. I will tell you though, this video is sponsored by Shop Carls and Catch Co. They're the makers of all the Guggen Squad hard baits as well as the Carl's Amazing Baits brand, the 10,000 Fish brand, Biospawn. If you haven't checked those out, you need to hit the link in the description. It'll take you right to Shop Carl's and you can pick up some of those baits. They're legit, man, they're legit. So, we're gonna get right into this. We've got Chris right back here, Jerk Bait Master. Now, this bait, Chris, do you know what this bait's called? Can you read it? It says the Jerk Queen. The Jerk Queen. I think that's really cool because I knew a girl in high school that was nicknamed the Jerk Queen and I think it's really cool that they named a bait after her. I'm sure that has no connotations to it at all. Probably shouldn't have said that. We'll edit that out. So anyway guys, stay tuned. Uh, we're gonna get right into this video uh, right about now. So the bait we're talking about today is this guy right here, the Jerk Queen. Um, it is from China, as Trump would say. It comes from China. All the things from China right now, not really a fan of. Really not a fan of this thing. Battery powered, vibrates when it hits the water, lights up, does some really weird stuff. I'm not sure about it. It's got two ball bearings in it, it's just super heavy. I don't really, don't really, don't really like it. I'm gonna compare this thing to the Guggen Squad Scout. This guy right here. Um, me and Chris are gonna rotate fishing these. So I'm gonna start out, Chris, you're gonna fish this one first. All right. I'm gonna fish this one, then we'll swap somewhere in the middle, see if we can get bit on either one of them. And uh, then we'll give a full comparison at the very end of what we thought of them. Uh, Cause I think this might be the biggest scam on the internet. <laughs> let's get right into it and uh, let's jump on our chest so we can uh, show you what we're doing. As far as a comparison goes, guys, I don't know that it gets more like spot on than this. They're both blue back, silver, got the little dot. So this bait can be found on Amazon. It is $19.99. So it is an expensive, somewhat expensive jerk bait. It's battery powered when it hits the water. It's actually got a blue light that comes on inside of it and it starts vibrating. Honestly, the design, like the paint job, not terrible, but I question these hooks. I question the weight of it. The fact that it sinks butt first is a little weird. Um, it does have, look, we've got, how many is that? We've got, looks like two really giant BBs in there. Little ball bearings to give it some rattle. Um, not that it needs any more rattle already than it's got between the batteries shifting around inside of it. But it's called the Jerk Queen. It is straight from China, which we know all great things come from China. That's why we're all stuck at home right now, right? Alright, let's go. Let's uh let's start this little deal. Like I said, we're gonna fish them for about 30 minutes each. And uh, mine looks like it's a slow sink. It's probably where the batteries are. Oh geez, it vibrated on me. It vibrated on me. <laughs> It just went. Bzzz. It did. I got a little. I got a little bit of a tingle. Conditions are a little less than ideal. We're not fishing really clear water. It's kind of muddy, but you've got, I don't know, probably a foot to two foot visibility. I don't know. Maybe that light on it, and that vibration, will help me. I think I got a fish. Oh, he got off. He got off. He got off. Those stupid hooks. Those stupid, stupid hooks. I had a fish. The other thing is, is this thing is so heavy. I think they can, I mean, there's a little bit of leverage that can be used there. Chris is hooked up on the Guggen Scout. 
Got one. Got one. So far, I'm still zero with the ridiculous one. And they short and fat. Look at belly. These back hooks keep getting caught on each other. Stop vibrating. Stop it. I think I might. Oh. Nope, 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 nope. I didn't. I got a stick. Nope. I really thought that was a fish. I really did. I was wondering why I wasn't fighting. I think it's time to switch. What what real like what real is that? Five three. Okay, you're working with a six three, and it's gonna cast a mile. But all right, now that I've moved on to the Guggen Squad Scout, let's talk about this thing for a minute. It's got eight ball bearings in it. Gives it a nice little little knock. It tilts hooks are super sticky. If you didn't just see that stuck in my hand there four to six foot diving right there on the belly super easy to read nice compact design um, they actually make the scout junior as well that's got just two hooks a little bit shorter um, this one look at even even the subtle little detail look at that see your uh, little split ring right there it's in an oval shape and that is just so you don't ever get it crossed up in that single right there um, and break your line or have it come off really really well thought out design on this thing and uh as you saw from chris it catches fish got one i better have one yeah i do yeah i do he swiped at it he swiped at it i don't even have him in the mouth he swiped at it Got on top of the head. There you go, ladies and gentlemen, on the Guggen Squad Scout by Catch Co. Nice one. Ready? I'm ready, Freddy. Big your, splash. And your high drops. What do you think of it, Chris? Which one? Either one. Well, the Guggen Squad, since we're going with the Trump theme here, making fishing great again. <laughs> as far as the jerk quaking, I mean, it looks good, but. Just didn't get any fish on it. That's really my gripe with it. I think the bait itself, the paint job on it, looked pretty good. I thought the paint job was pretty pretty well done. Uh, it's a little heavy. It sinks at a weird angle, like it doesn't sit flush in the water. It sinks back first. She twerks. She does twerk. She twerks to the water. She actually doesn't have a bad action to her, really. Terrible, but I don't understand the vibrating. I don't understand the the light I don't I don't get it I don't get it and plus we never got bit on it like we never were able to hook a fish and I probably because the hooks are terrible but also because I just think it's it's just an odd looking shape it's bigger it's thicker it's she thick man she th she's the opposite of what sir mix a lot said she's not little in the middle and she doesn't have a lot of back she's she sinks in the back though anyway guys honestly if you want to cop a really good jerk bait for as little as $6.99, you can go on Shop Carl's right now and get the Guggen Squad Scout. They also make the Scout Junior. It's just slightly cheaper. You can get it as low as $6.29 on the website. All you got to do is hit the link in the description. It's where I buy all my baits. Uh, sign up for a Shop Carl's membership and save 30% off pretty much everything in the store. So that would be my recommendation. This bait right here, legit. This bait right here, $20 that you could have bought, I don't know, three of these guys pretty much for. Um, because you get free shipping, by the way, when you use your Shop Carl's membership. But that's gonna do it for today's video. I want to thank Chris for jumping on the video, showing us how it's done on the jerk bait. I actually pulled in more things than you. Did you know that? Like, I, I hooked two more sticks than you and one, and one fish. We tied on fish, but on sticks. I got him beat. You landed on I got you beat. Today's episode is the B and B fishing is brought to you by Bark because that's the only thing I was able to snag those limbs by was Bark. <laughs> Y'all guys have a good one. We will catch you on the next one. Hopefully we got some heaters coming up and uh y'all can y'all can just hang tight and enjoy the show. Guys, Chris, later. Yeah.